Since its launch last year, excitement has been growing over how Google Glass will be used. Billed as one of the next big things in consumer electronics, some airlines have already started to adopt the technology. A screen just above the eye enables staff to check passenger and flight information. In addition, an inbuilt camera scans the ticket and passport, meaning boarding is complete within a click of the eye. The feedback has been very good. Um, it's new technology, so people are very curious. Um, I've allowed some passengers to try the glasses on. While the technology speeds up boarding, airline Virgin Atlantic, which is piloting the glasses, also believes they add a little quirkiness to the in-flight experience. Anything we can do to inject a little bit of magic or a little bit of personalization into that whole process to make people feel that it's a special uh, thing that they're doing uh, is great, really. Swiss company Sitter is behind the software which is being used to welcome airline passengers. The firm has been trialling the application in Virgin's VIP wing at London's Heathrow Airport for faults. In the future, the technology could also be used to tell airline staff passengers' dietary preferences. At Sitter's headquarters in Geneva, the job of engineers is to test all kinds of gadgets for use in the airline industry, including the most bizarre and outlandish. Thank you. In March last year, we asked ourselves, given all the wearable computer technology that is now available, is there a way of using this to speed up boarding? If I put on these glasses and turn on the application which we've developed, it will instantly scan the boarding pass and passport. And even though we are wearing this, we are able to interact with the passenger, so you do not lose proximity. Have a good flight. Thank you. People in the airline industry see a lot of future possibilities with these innovative products. They relay a lot of information and the other advantage for the airline worker is that it's hands-free, so they can do more if the customer needs it and have all the information just in front of their eyes. Many think the hands-free benefit of wearable technology offers tremendous potential for airlines and business in general. There's lots of other areas. Um, most of our staff that, that work for the company are mobile, whether they're on the ground or they're fixing planes, turning planes around, um, or, or up in the air, flying the planes or serving our passengers on board. The, the majority of them are mobile. So trying to find areas where this sort of technology could benefit them doing their job and also the, in improving the customer experience. While still on trial in London, if the pilot is deemed a success, there are plans to use the technology at air hubs in New York and San Francisco. Yeah.